How do you know if a website is safe to use? While shopping, sharing personal information, or even just browsing. Hmm, those look tasty. Because there are high and low assurance certificates, and browsers display them both exactly the same. A padlock only indicates encryption. It tells a user nothing about the entity behind the site, many of whom don't want you to know. You have to look beyond the lock. TLS, sometimes called SSL, certificates should do two things. Certify the site is using valid encryption and confirm the site owner's identity. Validation, a background check of sorts, has been used for more than two decades online for a reason. Most fraudulent sites today hide behind the padlock icon by using low assurance, zero identity SSL certificates. Your information is encrypted directly into the wrong hands. So here's a step-by-step -step guide to verify website owners' identities by looking beyond the lock. In the latest version of Safari, click on the padlock in the address bar. Extended validation, or EV, the highest assurance certificate, will display an extra message in this box identifying the issuing certificate authority, or CA, which validated the company, their location, and 12 other forms of identity background checks and details. Always look for the pop-up message, Safari is using an encrypted connection to whatever site you're using. Now click Show Certificate. The certificate route is displayed at the top. CAs often use an EV route when they issue high identity certificates. This is good. EV and OV organization validation, secured websites, are doing more to show users they can be trusted. The leading brands on the internet are committed to your safety and privacy, and you can always identify these brands when you look beyond the lock. But on domain validation, DV, or the lowest level of certificate, the browser will provide zero details about the domain owner. That indicates a low assurance site, and you, the consumer, assume the risk. Always avoid sharing personal information with websites that use DV certificates, as they do not ensure a business is authentic or legitimate. And that's it. Now you know how to look beyond the lock to keep your data safe and in the right hands.